I want to thank the two of you for one of the most memorable nights I have ever spent in the theater, which was last night. Oh, oh my gosh, that it means, you know how much that means to me. I know you've seen everything, so that means a lot to us. We, that cast does an amazing job. We're a family at this point. And now I can finally say it to the two of you. Welcome to Broadway. Yeah. Look at this. Yeah. How does it feel? So surreal, crazy, euphoric. Uh, so proud of those people, the, that cast, which is phenomenal. Every single one of them, of course, Anna and Josh, that have really, they've worked so hard and they're so observant and they don't ever stop working. So we're blessed. And okay. by the way, it's always always good to see your smiling face all the way from the beginning. You always give well, us the support. So from thank you so much. You were here thank you theater. so much. Watching your leads last night, I said, oh my God, she's Gloria. Oh my God, he's Emilio. It morphs into them. What is it like for you when you watch them? It's funny because other people notice more than me because obviously I don't know what I look like or do or the things, my mannerisms. But my daughter, for my daughter and my sister to say to me, oh my God, it was like, it's you up there. Like, what happened? She watches you. She, she's got all these little things down. And, you know, I just see her as an amazing artist and actor and amazing singer and passionate and good girl, really and solid individual, so I'm very happy. A great cast, great cast, and you know something, the Miami Sound Machine in the stage, so that, you know, you know, I think the, what I love is real, the whole thing is real, and that's, that people, you know, I think people are looking for that, for real things, and I think they're going to get that in your feet. You know, there's a universal story to this. Anybody who has a family, anybody who's been through anything. I mean, there were people from all over the world here last night at every age having the time of their life. That must make you so proud. It makes us so happy. I have fans that flew in from everywhere. And I still, in my, in my, whenever I've done a show, I have from little kids to older, elderly people. And I think that's a beautiful thing. That's what we were going for. We want theater lovers to come and whoever they are to identify with some part of this story. And to have your daughter, her song is so beautiful, what that means to you. Yeah, it means uh, so much because one of the things the doctor told me, you, they said you will never have more kids. <laughs> so to imagine to have it, my baby doing that is amazing, and you know, to go roll it with Gloria. But that makes me always give me like a little bit, especially in that moment of the show, which, you know, is It's full crucial. circle for me yeah. because they did indeed say that there was slim to none chances, and it took quite a, while, quite a bit to have her. And now to see that 25 years later, after, you know, this story, she co-wrote the only original tune with me in the play and even though she's not in it physically i go you're in it in the best way possible you would made something new and that i'm very proud of her and you know the book is flawless to this show talk about collaborating with your book writer yes oh my gosh well we gave him free reign because i'm a big fan and i think you have to have one person's idea so he spent a year and a half talking to us he talked to my mother a lot <laughs> and uh and he did, he did so much research. When he sent me that first book, I cried. And he chose the music. I told him, you do it. It's, this is your story to tell. So as you're standing here on the biggest red carpet on Broadway, it's your opening night. How do the two of you feel? My heart is beating out of my chest. I say, God bless America. That's the main thing. You know, we are living in a country that dreams come true. And that's, that's what this show is all about.